Hello guys, I trust you all are doing great. Another businessman has called out the Afrobeat singer Davido for allegedly owing him 218 million naira out of the 326 million naira contract agreed over a football project. Abu Salami, who is also a photographer, said that Davido did not honor the agreement in any form and shared receipts of the singer and his people constantly demanding money. Abu Salami, who is a photographer, claimed that he and the singer Davido agreed to a football contract and he kicked off by scouting for young talented footballers in different states. The photographer said that out of the 322 million naira agreed to be paid to Davido, he also coughed out 218 million, yet the singer did not show up or promote the show. Abu Salami shared the receipt of the different times he sent money to Davido and his lawyer and the time he sorted their food, hotel and domestic fees. He added that there were boys in his camp he needed to feed and all effort to get Davido to honor the contract or refund the money had been futile. Davido's lawyer, Bobo Ajuda, was also called out for aiding the singer and facilitating stealing money from people. The photographer don't talk say, oh more, you no go end here. So he go try scatter the video in our life. Say if you no refund the money, unless the video refunds him his money. He also said that Davido sent his 30 billion gang, you know, people made a coin even try bring and down over his own money. He wrote, I quote, Davido, I promise you, if you don't pay the money you owe me, you will face problems after problems. You'll be only, only, only. The security you put for your mind, say, now they won't take, make me down. No worry, your cock will fall soon son of a billionaire acting like you know something went no good Usalami also shared a video of the alleged the video people gang you know where they try bring and down now this accusation has generated mixed reactions with a quite number of people wondering why the video is always and always caught in a mess unlike other artists some of the comments read Whiskey, I will forever stand you. Another person wrote, Please bring out the contract you signed with him for 218 million. Show us how you spent the money. Show us evidence. You saved someone's number as short guy David. What should we do with that? You begged him to post video you did in his garden. He didn't. You wanted him to give you money for food for 106 boys. How? Nigerians have also called out a guy called Very Dark Man, said he is supposed to come out and drag the video the way when they drag other people. But you know, go feel come out because say the video don't kind like silence him, you know, with giveaway and bringing him to Lagos. They say the video is too smart. People that are supposed to drag him more are already on his payroll. Another person commented, Never have they dragged Whiskey or Bonner Boy. Why always David? Let's call a spade a spade. Following this, the guy called Dark Man, or very Dark Man, I don't know. So he has actually come online to say something about this report. So you're going to also watch his video. But well, guys, what do you think about all this? It, for me, I always tell people, I would say I suggest, whenever you have a contract or make a contract with somebody, you know, like with agreements, it's very important for you to put it down, either in recording, writing, get witnesses, you know, and when the problem arises, you, you can use alternative dispute resolution, that is ADR. It's a means of settling a complaint out of court. If you don't have money to go to court, depending on who you are having this problem with, okay? Social media is not a court. People will only, you know, comment with sentiments. If you know somebody is owing you, probably the person is more wealthier than you, you have to find a way. 
not to also bring yourself down or maybe put your life at risk guys like i said what do you think about this watch the rest of the video and don't forget to follow my page and i will see you guys in my next video one love he's um he's another guy and one of his other guys called banco tunji his cousin special five five percent of my company his Are lawyer you is Are you your baby just, just you know just allow it just allow it that's all done now isn't it you get me so you guys can see that what i'm dealing with, with this yeah i'm telling him this is madness it doesn't make sense to anyone like there's a timeline to the project but this is what i want you to guys to really get you see david's boys here yeah? everybody's got to worship david if you don't worship david like you can't be in a, in a circle you've got to worship him he's got to be like a god was a p i tell you that one for free no 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 it's not even a joke like i tell you free of charge is a p you get me so especially saying he messed up his relationship with david so doesn't want to push too much so i just let it be you get me let me know when you need my help i still need contracts i said i'll send him the contract once the press release or rather once the press conference is done you know what i mean which david didn't come for obviously but we'll get we'll get to that in another video you want to put all them a percentage of your business for what send them contracts for what that don't make any sense yeah babe the thing is to f david i had to give his cousin his sister back and forth what's going on how's this project going what's happening but i'm getting bare heat and I'm, I'm explaining to special like yo i'm dying out here you get me what's up with david um oops but what i like what i like special for at this point is that he can feel my pain do you get me like when a man is a, a real man you know he can feel your pain because i was dying to put this real man in you know, it he can feel your pain because i was to put this project alive to bring it alive and i'm doing it all by myself you get me at this point i'm doing it all by myself there's no david and we all banked on david's publicity and you know bringing sponsors you know and all that but this is where you know i'm thinking wow this guy's a fake guy what have i done so here you can see 209 has been spent on david already well we the budget ended up at 218. <sighs> man madness so special listen yeah I mean, I don't mean to call you out because you're my guy. I know you from time, innit? But at the end of the day, you f David. And right now, I don't give a f about nobody. You get me? So it is what it is. But at the end of the day, my job is to show people that, you know, this guy's a thief, innit? You get me? He's a thief. I ain't mincing my words, you know? And he's soft. Well, let's leave it as that, anyway. So if you look at this message, guys, that's reading it, especially those of you David O fans, innit? That you think is God. I thought so too at some point in time, but right now, it looks so little to me. Um, yeah, man, especially just talking about documents, innit? About his documents, to give him 5% of my company for all the work he's done with, you know, trying to sort out David, talk to David and all that. Um, and then he asks me this question, so you can just read along, innit? So at this point, obviously, like, the sponsors are giving me hits, like, phone calls. All right, so I know a lot of you have seen this video of the video where they say the video and the bodyguard, they don't buy a person. You know, a lot of people don't tag me to this video. They say if I don't talk about them, say well, say they know say I don't talk about them. Say the video don't pay me, the video don't lodge me, don't hold my voice. Blacks or rocks, okay. You know me. First of all, those boys in those in that video, now the video bodyguard quite alright because now them me I chill with, now then chill with me. All of us we did together, you know, we flex. Now this particular video, I say happen for Abuja. First things first. Now when I reach Lagos, I understand say a lot of news where they go online, no be actually what it be. You understand? But that's by the way. Secondly. The politicians of this country will continue to use us like mumu if we know they ask the right question. Now, I give everybody where don't tag me 24 hours to provide person where they buy. If you provide the person where they buy, everybody can unfollow me immediately. You people don't know how to ask the right question, and this is a problem. So these people came online to tell us say they don't want the people buy person. When I know ask where the person where they buy, the person where they buy no get family. Where the person brother, where the person sister. Provide who they buy. It's just where they make my videos. So you know me. If I make video, I'll put I'll put evidence on top, put everything. You understand? Where the person where they buy, provide, I give it 24 hours. Everybody, including the blogs that posted it, bring 24 hours. Hmm? Now, to the guy where posted that video, where does the video they go on? You understand? Where posted the video? I talked to that guy yesterday because I go check my message box. I see say no dropping message. I talked to the guy. I tell the guy, say, all these things where you post online, you know, necessary. You understand? You say the video they owe you 200 and something million naira. This is not something where you say you carry go legal. If you know, say which you they talk now true. You see, say all these things where they post online. You see, say online people won't follow you. All those people where they ginger you online. Now the rival music gang. It just be like any news come out online about whiskey. The people where go they where go they enjoy the news, if not negative news. Now the other music people. 
The bad news come out about Bonner Boy and the other two side. So the bad news come out about David. You go see people go the full lamb and the other music side. Music, this is entertainment, especially for these Lagos. They don't like yourself. Envy, jealousy, the entertainment industry in, in Lagos is toxic. Do you understand? So that being said, as I did like this now, if I see any news about this kid, I see any news about Bonner and the rest, I go cool down, sit down, look and wait, find evidence before I put my mouth in the talk. And again, I also want to say before, I don't feel like I don't talk about whiskey, they don't Bonner, but I'll explain why. Because these people don't get community, and the community where these people don't get, even if they tell them truth, they don't want to hear you. Do you understand? Come talk about whiskey, even if not true. Some people don't go one year out. Sentiments don't enter them. In the name of fan base, in the name of support. If you can't talk about David, the same thing. If you talk about Bonaparte, the same thing. Get people say sentiment don't enter. A lot of them, they don't get a lot of time where they don't say another artist. If you another big artist where they first club, where should person? Where that one they say the, the person even come online come cry. What's it happen? How many days ago? So this particular one where they go on now. Like I said, I give people 24 hours to provide the person with their part. When I don't learn anything from this normality now, I don't learn anything. The way people say they carry, when people say no happen, they just carry two people. Go! Put that inside. Oh, no, no, learn. Now they don't bring another one. Provide the person. If you don't provide them, don't see the mumu. And if you provide and finish, everybody will follow me. I don't want to get any other follower. Just provide the person where you buy. Show us who buy. This is why politicians could use us. If you don't ask the right question in Nigeria, we go suffer for like for like hundred years more to come. Our children will still suffer. Because you people are moved by sentimental reasons in this country. Sentiments don't chop on a body. Once the thing just come out and are you up, you could be you all will learn, and you all will learn in the hard way if you don't ask the right question. Don't play. You will learn, and you will learn in the hard way.